have you ever been bothered or actually you know compelled by something that you eventually decided with your own self that yeah even not the person who bother you you consider all the people in his surrounding millions of people in his surrounding you thought that these all the people are the same as the person is well the same story is here that i bring and want to share with you people it's a very interesting story and will really make you inspired and make you understand that how did he became uh, convinced by religion of islam and first torture and bother in on many ways multiple direction he had been stuck and he thought himself that it is a evil not a good for the humanity so let's start the story without wasting our time so that 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 is the story of the devil the devil who born in the california state of america he born in a christian family he has fed on jesus peace and blessing be upon him and he was saying that he's knows be like god himself because it has been taught to him and he was narrating that actually we have been taught the story of adam and eva that how the serpent tempted the eva and the eva convinced the adam to eat the apple from the forbidden tree so since that time the the evil started the sin started and they got punishment and he was saying that actually you know i had a lot of question at those time and i was telling myself that how can a man be a god and i was driving my mother with some craziest questions and i did my mother were saying and the discussion were ending with this one thing my mother was saying the god work in a mysterious way and we don't have to ask question about the god we were just finishing that and i was confused over there but i was believing and i was telling myself okay that's about the god and that's true so i should have to believe i should have to put all my belief totally right then when he grew up he decided in 2011 to start at some work and he started some work well within the work the co-worker he was also a believer and he was a christian person and he believed that actually the jesus sacrificed for us and even though if we do some bad deed doesn't matter still we're gonna go to the heaven so the david said uh, th that actually i got confused that how is that possible that the god's son will, uh, came to this world he sacrifices for our sins uh, himself and we will be forgiven totally right so i was a little bit confused that can't be the nature that can't be the law and i asked him the question is this really true and well you gonna do are you gonna do sins uh, just for the sake of that that the god sin sacrifices himself for you and uh, now the thing is that you will do what whatever your heart want whatever your desires are demanding from so he said absolutely i'll do that and since that time i was totally confused that for what purpose the god created us there should be some test after the test there should be something to achieve i mean to say uh, uh, to to get and to chase right the reward because naturally the lie is simple within this world if somebody do hard work if somebody go through all the tested then obviously at the end of the day what happening he's getting reward for that so he said in the um in 2001 when actually and when he converted to islam he was 46 years old so he was saying that in 2001 before the 9 11 the tragic attack i actually gone in the military defense military right and yeah i was working as a military agent for uh, the um, America by considering myself as a patriotic and the country protector uh, that will protect the country from the evil people and I consider after the 9-11 that was in the trending what Islamophobia so I was 
really confused and I got understood that yeah these are totally the evil people then later on a company I did agreement with that company that they were working they were working on a mission in Afghanistan and Iran and we have been sent to those countries and I came over there with this mindset that all the people are evils all the people are bad I don't have to interact with those people I have to actually protect my country as a patriotic from those people so I thought these people are totally evil and the Islamophobia was just totally entrenching when I went to the I amazed by the peaceful relationship of those people those people were totally friendly they were eating together they were making evolution they were praying to the God uh, they were helping each other they were hugging each other and I spent a lot of time with those people but we were not allowed to intact or just in a kind of interaction or touch with those people so then we finished from there and I get back to home when get back to home and the 2021st you know I, my mind totally got changed by seeing those people right and when we finished from the mission I get back to home and we were at home right and then the pandemic 2021st or 